Gold statue, yes, yes, yes. Finally, my review, my thoughts on it. I did a trailer reaction for the trailer when it dropped. Check that out if you can. But if you don't want to, just watch the review. All right, let go. Hey you, welcome back to my channel. My name is Adenike Adivayo Esho. I am a movie and lifestyle vlogger. This is my channel where I do awesome stuff. So please subscribe to my channel, all right? Thank you. All right, so Gold Statue is a brand new movie directed by Tade Ogido. Like I mentioned in my reaction video, Uncle Tade has been gone for a while. All right, he, he, be, he been gone for like years. Okay, but he back, he back, he back. <laughs> Your grandpa believes in the existence of the gold. Yeah. Grandpa, just tell me where this thing is. It's simple now. I'm going to type things on it. I'll put it on Google. If anybody types your name, Grandpa is sure. Boom! Who is Google? He is back with this movie titled Gold Statue. It features Gilbert Afalayo, RMD, Kule Remy, Shola Shoboale, Ali Baba, Nubad Young, uh, Kevin Ikeduba is in there somewhere, Ricardo Agua is in there, uh, Brave Freeze, Abisola Ayola, you have Judith Aldu, Etinosa. Idemudia is in there, and then you have Ivan Jagede as well. It tells the story of this guy who found out that there's this treasure, there's this gold statue hidden somewhere, and you know how much is worth and all of that. So himself and his friend decide to go in pursuit, and then he found out, oh, in actual fact, this statue is located in my village in Elisha, in a prison. And the statue was estimated to be worth 500 billion million dollars 500 million dollars i believe and then it now went up to one billion dollars like it was just they were just calling the money you understand they were calling it they were and every time my heart was doing kicking kicking <laughs> so himself and his friend played by clearly decided to go in pursuit of this statue number one the casting in this film was intense Okay, <laughs> but compared to situations where we have just seen a lot of cast and half of them were probably not necessary or irrelevant, this one, it wasn't, we didn't particularly focus on anybody's stardom because half of them were all in the same category, prisoners, Elewo. <laughs> Star power wasn't necessarily what sold the film, which I liked. Still on the casting, can I just say that Gabriel, Gabriel, Give her a flyer. It's such ah, it's good. It's good. You have to give it to him. That guy is good. He carried the film with his performance, his emotions, his delivery, his reactions, the way he, the, his mannerisms. Of course, Kule Remy held his own, and then you have RMD holding it down. And Shola Shobowale was classic. Shola Shobowale. She brought the extraness and the over the top, which was. Which what in this movie, you know, it didn't tie me out in this movie because this is a woman whose son is in prison. A Yoruba woman whose son unexpectedly ends up in prison. Like, yes, no, please, all the way. Be dramatic as much as you want. So I loved it. I enjoyed the humor in the film. It wasn't, it was, it was a lot of drama and a lot of comedy, but it wasn't silly comedy, it wasn't slapstick, it wasn't dry, it was actually quite funny. The grading was good, I liked the cinematography, I liked the storytelling as well, because the story was told in a very interesting way. And it wasn't even until I finished watching the film and I got in home and I was talking to someone about it, that I now realized that, come to think of it, this movie, was longer than an hour 30 minutes and then i checked and i realized it was like two hours and two hours and something but i didn't i didn't feel it all because the storytelling was well done it was so abstract like the right point where you're starting to get hard the story just changes direction and you're like oh what i enjoyed the suspense i enjoyed the intrigue i just thought it was a well packaged film was he groundbreaking? Oh my God, no. But it was, it was well put together, it was well produced. The makeup, the, the SFX in the film, loved it. It was gory at some point, so if you don't like blood, at some point you might have to close your eyes and stuff. But it was, it was good. What I didn't quite like about it, I already mentioned in the teaser and the trailer that I saw, I didn't like the CGI. It was just so fake and so obvious. I was just like, ah, stop it. I also felt like there were quite a few potholes in the story you know, like, like, put all that I was thinking about, and you know, I saw it in Surulere in Lagos. 
the cinema is too late. People like to talk. People is really they like to talk. They are watching film. They are talking, which I find exhausting and tiring. But they like to talk. As we were watching things, I was thinking about skimming to myself. They were saying it like, ah, why didn't they do this? Like there were clear options and there were there were clear steps that certain people would have taken, if indeed they were investing as much as was supposedly said basically what i'm saying is you would have to just excuse a few things and just not use your common sense in a few places going back to the story as well you know okay so there's digging there's something on the ground i'm just like we're clearly not on the ground but it's okay you know like even in prison break they never dug that deep <laughs> but like i mentioned earlier there are just a few things you just have to excuse uh you just have to say whatever for you to be able to actually just enjoy the film for the most part i did enjoy ghost statue i thought it was a very good movie i think you should watch it if you haven't seen it and you have an opportunity to go check it out yeah it's definitely worth your time you would enjoy the story if for anything you enjoy going on the adventure <laughs> Jiga, what do you guys think for those of you that have seen it for those who haven't seen it, what are you anticipating from this film titled ghost statue whatever your thoughts are please leave them down below in the comment section thank you guys so much for watching i love you love you love you i can't wait to see you again very very soon you know how we do it remain in god and god bless you Mwah.